Now, just when you think summer is done, Andrew is here to send over some summer fun. Can't wait. Hello fellow doll lovers, Barbie Nation here, welcome back to my channel. Hello everyone, thank you so much for tuning into another video with me today. My name is Aryan, aka Barbie Nation, and what I do is I collect dolls. I play with dolls, I talk about dolls, and every now and then I give them a super cute makeover. So if you're into anything cute, sweet, and petite, definitely subscribe to my channel to get some lovely pastel glitters on your feed. Now let's dive into some new subscriber mail today. Here we go. <laughs> So it is that time again where we can expect some major epicness from Andrew, my friend from Canada who sends over uh, some boxes lately. <laughs> and this one will add to that. So yeah, this one is uh, a summer box themed box. And it's actually been waiting here for quite some time to be unraveled. And I'm so excited to find out what's all inside this box. Yeah. It is a huge box, by the way. It's just massive. Let's just get into it straight away. But before I do, of course, first off, Andrew, again, thank you so much for the millionth time by now. It is so amazing. And your creativity with these boxes is so freaking magical. It is like going to a theme park and seriously, enjoying the ride so much you want to do it over and over and over and i haven't even seen the inside of the box yet so okay i had to remove the top because it was very heavily taped and i already saw how it opens oh my gosh you guys you guys really have to see this are you ready Look how freaking awesome! <laughs> it can't even fit the screen. Oh my gosh. He literally decorated the whole inside of this box. I, th the level of detail that he did this is just, oh my gosh. This is a pure work of art and... <laughs> it goes all the way inside. So, of course, we have the card, so let's read that first. And the sun, of course, which we will probably not see very much again soon, so enjoying this picture while it lasts. <laughs> let's just first read this card. Look at this little cute guy. <clears throat> this time, the sketch is in the box, not the card. Hmm. Arjen, you are like the summer, warm, bright, and <laughs> makes everyone happy and in a good mood. When I think of the boys of summer, I think of you, especially when you have a tan. Have fun in the sun, uh, wishing you and yours nothing but the best forever and always, Andrew from Canada land. It's, it's like entering a summer portal. Okay, here we go. Are you guys seeing this? 
He made a drawing of me. Oh, this is just the cutest. Wow, oh, this is just adorable. It is everything. Thank you so much. I never, I think I never actually received fan art like this. I don't know if I should open this already. Oh, it says something. Aryan, just a little contribution to your lookbooks. Everything a princess could want. I never even knew these existed. So this is a Cinderella flashback. Look at this. Wow. This is gorgeous. And Sleeping Beauty. Oh. With all these accessories, this is like a total slumber party set, which I am loving, of course. <gasps> And this is from, okay, this was obviously Sleeping Beauty and Cinderella. Now this, that little dog. Oh. Who, which princess would this, Shopping Spree is the title of this one. Sweet Dreams, Night on the Town. Oh my gosh. Who would wear this? I think Belle, I guess. Oh my gosh. I never knew these fashion packs existed in the first place. These are fabulous. These look really detailed, really nice material, and they look definitely Y2K. Oh, oh my gosh. Okay. Now this looks very, I don't know what I'm getting into, but Whoa, 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 oh, 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 it's, it's a case file, you guys. Open case file first. So it says here, case 00369, the disappearing dolls. Oh my gosh. So, story time, you guys. This is going to be epic. I know it for sure, so... Yeah. Let's get into this top secret case file fantasy. <laughs> we want to thank you for all your exceptional award-winning reporting, Angel Aryan, keeping doll lovers across the world informed and entertained. We just completed an international investigation and can confirm your suspicious as correct. Certain doll lines are disappearing, never to be seen or heard from again. This is very unsettling in the vinyl verse with so many vinyl vanishings, some vintage, including our favorite math challenged crimped hair cuties, the timeless teen talks. Angel, I will be sending you deep undercover into the toy manufacturing conglomerate where you will take on the identity of a new Mattel doll designer. And your mission, should you ex choose to accept, would be to create a prototype ready for production of a Wave 2 Teen Talk Barbie. Destined for store shelves in 1993, your talking teen dream doll would require four memorable things to say, be dressed to impress in multi layers of lace loveliness, and have hair crimped for the gods. Reaching out so far that she can only enter a room sideways. Good luck, Angel with that crimping iron. I would cross my fingers for you on that one, but you know, molded plastic hands and all. Just to avoid any blowback on this Teen Talk throwback, I have equipped you with the top secret cache of weapons of extraness that will guarantee perfection of your plastic payola. Don't forget, saving the world is tough. I have complete faith you will crack this case, Angel and resurrect our vinyl talking teen princess to the glory she deserved, but never received. Until now, love and kisses, Barbie. Okay, okay. I am in for some secret mission fantasy. Okay, this is giving me Charlie's Angels vibes. I read my file, I read my case, I have my mission. Prototype teen talk. Barbie. 
Wow. And he even put in like this little booklet of, um, this is actually Dutch. So you found a Dutch booklet about Barbie in 1994 and what's coming out in there in that year. Wow. Oh, this is so fun. This takes me back to, oh my gosh, to some very lovely memories. <gasps> Oh, this is so fun. And it, it, it actually holds a lot of the girls that I have high on my wish list. This is so fun. Oh. Oh, wow. This text on the front is to die for, seriously. I'm gonna read it in Dutch. It is so funny. Lieve vriendin, ik heb weer ontzettend veel leuke nieuwtjes voor je. Werkelijk, alles staat in dit mooie boekje. Als je iets, leuk, iets leuks ziet dat je graag wilt hebben, zet dan een kruisje in het witte rondje. Je kunt ook lid worden van de Barbie Club. Kijk maar snel in het midden van het boekje voor je inschrijfformulier. Veel plezier, kusjes, Barbie. Oké, okay, so I had to make a little way in this box. And um, yeah, we're down to the... Oh, I guess to my weapons for this uh, elaborate mission. You ready? Sharon sisters. I'm, I'm seriously, I am seriously. I am seriously shaking like a leaf. <laughs> Whoa. Oh my gosh, this is so freaking cute. Okay, so they can mix and match all of their fashions together, and it's all super cute colors. Lace for days. Oh my gosh. I would have died and gone to heaven if I was like six years old and got this whole darn set. So we got some extra fashions here. The well-known pink furry coat with some accessories. You guys, you guys. She has the sweetest, softest makeup ever. Okay, so look at her makeup. She has the softest lips. She is just adorable. Oh my gosh. So I can't ID which twist and turn Barbie this is. I mean, she has the twist and turn face. Am I right? We have another magical girl. This is a freaking fun combination of clothes, by the way. Even though it's not pastel. Oh, I think she's from a Fashion Fever doll. And this super 90s dress, <laughs> so cute. Oh, wow. Andrew, you went above and beyond again? Oh. Oh, she is adorable. She's from the Hair Kingdom, Dreamtopia, a princess line thing. This dress is adorable. And they all already have made to move bodies. I mean, wow. Oh, it's fashion, all right. It's fashion, people. This is so cute. It's all pastels. It's so Y2K. It's, it is everything. Oh, this shirt, this dress, this dress, this. Uh, 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 uh. Yeah, you can, you see those stripes, right? He is not kidding. No, <laughs> he is not playing this time. And I'm not even done. I need to collect myself here. We are continuing. Oh. The Barbie extra from the first five pack. Oh, that is amazing. <laughs> oh, 
Thank you so much. She has such cute items. That little puppy. She looks like my baby. She really is gorgeous. <laughs> I'm thinking about that meme that's... You're literally gorgeous. And there was also this bag. And this is from... Something Hair Adorables. Oh, Hair Amazing. Was this a blind bag thing? Do these... Do they also have blind bags? <gasps> Party balloons! And this is like something that could be used as a crown or a belt. We never got to see them. Not on the shelves. Only perhaps maybe on some European Amazon sites they popped up. But um, yeah. We never saw the light of day for them in stores. Well, maybe if you're somewhere in Europe and you saw them in stores, let me know down below. But I never saw them. This poster is everything. This is from the Barbie Look series from those dolls, which are highly sought after now. I love this girl. This was from a Barbie Fashionista deluxe set with extra fashions. Oh, oh, oh. We have some heads here. Um, I think a Dreamtopia Mermaid, a Dreamtopia Fairy, Nikki. Yeah, I loved this. I loved her when she came out. She was one of the first tall Barbies. She was a curvy mermaid. I was obsessed with the combination of her head and that lavender hair. This fashionista also with that beautiful face and that yellow toned hair. Wow, 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 wow. One of the first Barbie extra fashion packs, which I still didn't get, but thankfully you did. Oh, such cute items. I really am, yeah. I'm gonna save this for a cute lookbook. Oh, I have been, okay, I don't know if you guys had trouble finding this one, but I definitely had. I have been looking for this fashion pack for ages. It hasn't shown up on any European Amazon site or, I, or I'm just completely blind, I don't know. But nowhere in Dutch stores or Dutch online sites and that little doggy and those oh, donut ears star headband that uber, uber pastel furry coat is giving me life. And of course, the third Barbie Extra Fashion Pack. Wow, 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 wow. Those accessories are pretty darn dope. Do we still say that, dope? I think it's the whole skater vibe that made me say dope. And you sent another... Oh, oh wow, look at this picture. Barbie had the most beautiful artwork back in the day. And you sent over some more paper doll books yeah I just I just love the nostalgia of it all I mean this one this okay these are all press out pieces and then you can set them up as like oh my gosh look at all these tags and things that you can create But this picture screams my collection. Oh my gosh. Sleepover drama. Oh, inside of the box. And it's all covered in this summer print with decorations, with a sunflower, butterflies, rhinestones, hearts, rainbows. I have to remember my mission here. Aryan reporting, codename Angel, reporting for duty. Let's trace down those elements of Teen Talk 1993. Let's create something fabulous for the world. I've got my info, I've got my weaponry, I am ready to go.
Or she, her. What are yours? Let's go thrift shopping. I want to go doll hunting.
Oh my gosh. Was this fun or what? I mean, I had a blast restyling these dolls, going back to the 90s, going back to that teen talk fantasy. I really had a blast. You know, before we move on, I think it's time to, you know, dive a little further into that nostalgia throwback. I really sit down and appreciate this legend of a commercial that was airing during the teen talk time and also kind of like the controversy she, uh, she created by saying that math class is hard or math class is tough. I don't know the exact phrase, but you know what I mean? So yeah, she really is an iconic Barbie in Barbie history, actually. I love to shop, don't you? I can't believe my ears. I can't believe my eyes. Every teen talk Barbie is a different surprise. Mine says, want to have a pizza party? <gasps> Mine says, you're my best friend. Uh, and now she says, meet me at the mall. Cool. What's she going to say next? Listen. Do you have a crush on anyone? <laughs> you can't believe your ears are high. Teen talk Barbie, what a surprise. <laughs> Each Teen Talk Barbie doll says four different fun things. Barbie dolls each sold separately. So yeah, this commercial, oh my gosh, it gave me life. It's so funny. In today's world, people would definitely lose their mind over these sentences because they are so stereotypical to a weak woman figure, if I dare to say, which is of course, you know, not okay, of course, but you know, those were the times and I'm glad that people stood up and um, yeah, kind of like shook Mattel, you know, like, hey, give Barbie a break here. She can do more than you can think. And math class isn't that tough, you know, as you can see, as far as the restyling goes, here are the girls. And I actually had a thrifted bag of original teen talk clothes. So I thought it would be really fun to just, you know, mix and match these clothes. Uh, amongst them. So as you can see here, she has the jacket, she has the top and the pants. Millie here is rocking uh, another jacket with a purse and Miss Twist and Turn there. She's actually wearing that overskirt. So uh, yeah, and I've been watching Making the Cut lately, like really obsessive, uh, especially on uh, our holiday. We watched like two seasons. And so I could hear Tim Gunn in the background saying like, you know, this has to be cohesive. It has to scream a full collection. So yeah, that kind of like inspired and was my engine in restyling these dolls. As far as the crimping method goes, I actually ordered a crimping iron, but it never arrived and I was so frustrated. So I thought, okay, maybe this is like the universe telling me how to crimp without a crimp iron. So that's how I came up with these alternate methods to crimp their hair. So it doesn't give the quite result that you would get with like a crimp iron because then you will get that, you know, like those really tight 90s waves, but you know, it gives a bit of the fantasy. So it was okay enough and it was the best I could do. And like any good mission, you know, you gotta have a plan B. So far for the crimping uh, chapter. So I really couldn't bring myself to unbox these Sharon sisters. I mean, pink box, seafoam green background, these super lovely lacy outfits, their shiny hair. I mean, I just couldn't. The magic really stays in that box for me. I just think this is such an adorable set. I just... I couldn't bring myself. I'm sorry. Miss Extra in the back over there, she's getting her own video, of course. And of course, again, thank you, Andrew, for making this box such a event. I mean, your creativity with decorating these boxes, coming up with with the, the storylines, you know, the mission, the, the whole the whole vibe. You really did this with me today. I can't thank you enough. That artwork, those extra fashions, all the other cute little details you sent over, and the princess fashions. You gave me inspiration for days. If I could sing, I would burst into song just to scream and shout how much I would, I want to thank you. So, that was my little teen talk mission today. I hope you guys really enjoyed this video and leave a comment down below. Of course, which girl is your favorite restyling? Um, did you have teen talk Barbie back in the day? Um, 
you know, let's talk Teen Talk Barbie. Okay guys, so that's it for today. Thank you all so much for watching. If you like this video, then please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and click the bell icon next to the subscribe button to get notified about any new videos that I upload. You can also follow me on Instagram at Barbie Nation. That's usually where I post all of my updates. And until the next video, mwah, big, big kisses from me and I love you all.